Hello everyone! In today's tutorial, you will learn how to create a pop-up message. So let's get started. So guys, I will show you two ways which you can do the pop-up message. The first, first you can do it, the message can pop up automatically on the screen. And then the second way, you can either use a button to click so that the message will pop up or you can use a text or... So, let me, let me reduce my screen. To get started, I will bring in a box widget. Then expand it. Okay, then at next, I will change the color of my box widget. So I will change it to black. Okay, then. So I will change the text color here because I want to type in my widget. Let's say the size, I'll do it 80. And I'll type he uses cookies to make. your experience on this page better okay so next i will bring in I will bring a, a button okay so I will type in the button cookies policy In the text size, I'll do it 20. And the text color to white. Okay, it's in the middle. The next, I will bring in a line. and a button let me let me do it 15 the, okay the corner 15 let me And the text size, I'll do it 20. And I want the color of the text to be black. Okay. Then the button color, I want it to be white. I will change the text in the button.
and I will do the text bold. Okay, then Okay, so now I will make them dynamic panel to do their interaction so that when the page loads, the message here will just pop up on the screen. So to do that, I will make them dynamic panel. I will select, I will select everything and change it to dynamic panel. And hide it okay so to do the interaction I'll come to interaction new interaction page load hide or show so dynamic panel it's on show already I want it to fade when it show I want it to fade and bring to front so okay let me preview okay so when the page load then the message pop up on the screen so now the message is on the screen what i want is when i click the button here accept cookies i want the page here to hide and to do that i will double click it the dynamic panel then select the button here new interaction Click or tap, then show or hide. So, dynamic panel. I want it to hide. When it's high, it should fade this. Okay, so let me preview. Okay, so this is the first way. The when you when you want your message to pop up on the screen automatically. This is how we do it. Then the next way is I want when I click the button here, the message should pop up on the screen. So you can either use a button or a text or an icon. Okay, so me, I will use a button. To do that, I bring in a box widget. Let me. Okay, so bring in a box widget. Okay, then an icon. Use the icon a little. Okay, then next I will bring in a heading. Sorry, so and then the size of the heading is it 25 want to fit it in the middle okay in the paragraph
Okay, then next, I'll bring in a button. And change the text in the button. Then I'll do it bold. The size will be 25, then bold. And the text color to white. Okay, then. Now the text color should be. The text color should be black instead, so black. Then the button to the color. And it should be green. Then the text color, let me make it white. Okay. Then the corner to I'll do it 20 and see. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so to do the interaction, I will select I will select the box widget and the icon here. I will select everything and change it to dynamic panel. So I'll do it dynamic panel, then I will hide it. Then the box here and the subscribe, everything I will change it to dynamic panel. So I will select the box widget here and the icon, the text, and the subscribe button. So I'll change it to dynamic panel. So to do the interaction, I will double click because what I want is when I click the subscribe button here, the message box here should pop up. So to do that, I will select the, I will select it, the box and select the, the button here and go to interaction, new interaction, click or tap. Then show or hide. So the dynamic panel here, I want it to show. It's on show already. When it show, it should fade. Then bring to front. Okay, so let me preview. Okay, so. Okay, the message box, the message box pop up. So what I want is when the message box pop up, the subscribe button here should hide. So to do that, I will add action, show or hide. Okay, the subscribe button, so it should hide and fade. Let me preview then. Okay, so now it's pop up. Then the subscribe button here hide. So what I want is, what I want is when the subscribe button hide, then I will click the OK button here. It should also hide. Then the subscribe button should show. So to do that. I will double click the dynamic panel here, then select the OK. So new interaction, click or tab, hide or show. Okay, so I want it to hide. No, let me, let me. Okay, so, sorry. I will show then the dynamic panel. Okay, the subscribe button. I want it's on show already. I want it to show so fade and bring to front. So let me preview. Okay, 
it's on show already show then the subscribe button when i click the okay the subscribe button show but when i when the subscribe button show i want the message box here to hide so to do that i will select the okay and then add action so hide or show the dynamic panel here i will set it on hide and fade so okay guys so the message box pop up and then and then the subscribe button here hide then okay it's the subscribe pop up then the message box here hide so we can also do it another way instead of clicking so when i click the subscribe then the message box here pop up so instead of me clicking the okay for it to hide i can set it on waiting so that the page will it when it when when it show when the message box here shows when it show it will wait for like three to or four seconds then it will hide so to do that i will select the box and select subscribe so i will add wait to it so wait it, I want it to wait for like four seconds so okay and add action show or hide okay so I want it to show let me preview okay so Okay, so then it's a show on the screen now. It's waiting, so I should I, I will set it to another. I will, I will add another interaction so that when it waits for like four seconds, it will hide. So to do that, so okay, add action. Let me preview, then we'll see. Okay, so four seconds. It's high. So when it's high, the subscribe button here down, I want it to show. The button here, I want it to show. So to do that, I will select the subscribe and add action. So show or hide okay the dynamic panel here. so it's on show already i want it to show them fit let me check okay bring to front then okay so let me preview okay so guys this is how we do a pop-up message you can set it on wait or and you can also use a button to click for the message to pop up you can use a text you can use icon you can use any you anything you want to use you can use it this will be all for this tutorial if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe